Hello children, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see the second question related to class 10 construction. Draw a triangle ABC with BC is equal to 7 cm, angle B equals 45 and angle A is equal to 105 degree. Then construct a triangle whose sides are 4 by 5 times the corresponding sides of a triangle ABC. So now first for this what we have to do is you have to draw one small triangle okay rough rough figure a b c so in this rough figure when you see they have given 45 degree okay and angle a is given so angle a is 105 but this is on the vertex on the top of this triangle we don't know what is this base angle equal to so bc is equal to we don't know since they have given bc is equal to 7 centimeter we can start with the base BC is equal to 7 centimeter. We cannot interchange this because we don't know what is AB measurement. So now we need to find out what is uh, what is angle C. So we can find out angle C by using angle sum property. So we know that angle B is equal to 45 degree and angle A is equal to 105 degree. So now angle A plus B plus C will be equal to 180 degree because of angle sum property. So now angle C will be equal to 180 minus 45 plus 105 which is equal to 180 minus 150. So now angle C is equal to 30 degree. So now we got to know the base angle. It is 45 and here 30 degree. So now let's start constructing the triangle. So take out your scale. So now we will draw a line of 7 centimeter. So you can name this as BC 7 centimeter. I am using pen so that it will be clear for you. You can do it in pencil only. So now next angle B is equal to 45. So take out your compass and construct for 45 first you need to construct 90 degree. So now here it is 90. Now you need to bisect this 90. So when you want to bisect it, you can take more than half of it, draw an arc on both the sides from here and here you have to draw an arc and construct here 45 degrees. Okay. Now next is 30 degree. So to construct 30 degree also the same way, first you have to construct 60 and then bisect 60. You need to bisect this 60 degree. So you can take any measure. Yes. So now this will be 30 degree. So wherever both meets, mark that point as A. Okay. So now we will measure using the protractor whether it is 45 degree and 30 degree. So now you can see. It is exactly 45 and here when you see here it is 30. Now when we measure this angle it will be 105. Okay. So it will be 105. So you can see here 105 line here you can see. So now you have to take 1 1 centimeter arc here. Okay. So here 1 1 centimeter arc you need to draw here. Okay. 1 
2 3 4 5 so you have to draw 1 1 centimeter arc and then now you are going to join the last one so you will be joining here then after that now you are going to join the fourth one 1 2 3 4 p4 you have to join so you have to draw a parallel line if you want to draw a parallel line then the angle should be same right so now what you are going to do is you can just draw an arc here of any measurement you take so whatever is the measure here you see and draw the arc and now the same way in p4 also you are going to keep and draw the arc ok see what is the measure you have taken for the previous one and draw it in the same way so now you have to draw the parallel line you cannot draw just like that because the lines will not be parallel ok so now if you measure and see even the angles also will be same so whatever angle is you have drawn no it will be same see it is somewhat 104 or something so here also it should be same yeah here also you see it is 104 or something ok so now you can mark this point as c dash now the same way now you check what is the angle here what's the yeah this angle we know it is already 30 degree now the same way you are you are going to construct here 30 degree see where is 30 degree 30 degree is here so now mark point here and draw the line of 30 degree ok so now from here you can say this is 30 degree so this is also 30 degree here it is 45 and here it is 105 ok children so once again I will repeat here first you have to draw a triangle ABC uh, here you should know the base angle we did not know the base angle here so we calculated by angle some property and found out this angle is 30 degree then first you need to construct a b c then after you construct a b c now you have to construct an ang angle acute angle it can be any measurement you have to just draw an acute angle then since here it is 4 by 5 here you have to divide see the denominator if the denominator is 5 so now you have to divide this line into 5 equal parts if you take 1 centimeter everywhere it should be 1 centimeter and then later on you need to join this last uh, last point should be joined with C then construct the angle whatever is this angle construct here also and draw the parallel line so we will know that these two lines are parallel the same way here also you should draw the parallel line so just like that you cannot draw measure how much it is this is 30 degree the same way here also it should be 30 degree. Okay children, meet you in the next video. Until then, take care and bye children.